Hi friends, welcome back or welcome to my channel. If you're new, my name is Cynthia and I thank you for clicking on this video here. As you guys saw in the title, this is a sneak peek of my candle collection. I know many of you guys have been waiting for like a whole candle collection. I'm going to show you, give you an idea of how many candles I have. I don't know exactly how many, but I'm going to show you the candles, show you some crates, show you some areas that I keep candles, and you will see why I will need probably more than a day. At least I know I feel like I would uh, to be able to go through it all with you guys. But as I was cleaning, because I needed to clean this out and kind of organize, and I have like some candle holders in here and all of that, I want to see how to keep it. And as I was doing that, I thought, you know what, let me do a little video as well as tell you and show you why I'm not going to be participating in the buy two, get two candles for free this weekend because I don't have a place to put them and I'm going to slow down. I do want to participate in candle day big time. So I'm going to try to hold off and maybe, you know, I'm not going to say a no buy on candles, but one here or there, one or two. And since with this one, you have to buy four, I'm not going to do it. So let's get into it. You guys can kind of see what I have. I'm going to open this up. I'm going to take you to the two other areas. Uh, that I have candles. I have some over there. It should be like DVDs, the kids games, things like that in there, but I have candles under there too. And then I'm going to take you into the kitchen and my son's room. So let's go into the kitchen area in a cupboard that I have over there. So here's a cupboard in my kitchen that is supposed to be for like appliances, things that we wanted to put in here instead of having things laid out on the counters. But I put all these candles in here and it has, it comes with dividers. So you're able to I'm going to eventually take these out. They're probably going to move into storage or something. Anyways, um, so here we go. I think there's 22 crates in here. So you guys can do the math. And yeah, so that's what I have in here. I do have a candle that one of my friends got me at Aldi's. Um, yeah, I don't have an Aldi's over here, but they do have one in LA or a couple of them over there. So there is that one. I have not tried it yet. Uh, it's kind of hard because, you know, I just have that. Anyways, I'm not going to get into all of that on um, why I don't want to burn it yet. But those are all the candles all saying eventually I will um, do a video or at least I'm going to try my best to do a video where I show you each and every single one of these candles. Let's go into the closet that has a lot of candles as well. And this is my son's closet that I've taken over. Okay, so this is my son's closet. I had to bring the ring light because his blinds are broken. Basically, we can't open them. And it's dark in here. But do you guys see all the candles? It is uh, just to like another row behind there. And there's my one wicks like right here. So yeah, I need to move his the stuff out of here as well. I want him to have his whole closet. I have a couple of crates down here too. So let me show you. This is bad. Yeah, that's how many crates I have. Actually, those are empty because I want to put some candles in there so that I can, I need to bring more crates actually from work. But yeah, so you guys can see, it's a sneak peek, like I said, uh, some candles over here. And we'll show you exactly what I have over there because I'm going to be pulling them out because I was cleaning that area and I wanted to make it look a little neater. All right, let's go to the other section. And then... And then the other thing with this is I don't have them organized in any particular way. So that is the other bad thing. Yes, it's really bad. I need to have, you know, like the candles that are the same, I think, together. Like, you know, salted milkshake or the salted pretzel milkshake right there. Like put those together. I have like another one in another area. I have, I'll show you in a minute. I have peppermint hot chocolate in another area as well as this peppermint sugar cookie. Let me take you to that other area that I'm talking about. So this is the other area I was talking about. So I have some candle pedestals and holders in here. And you see how I have another peppermint hot chocolate here. I have this smoked vanilla whiskey, which I have started to um, burn. I want to talk about this one hopefully in another video or whether it's in an empties. And we have... I'm going to show you exactly what I have in here too because I wanted to pull these things out and I wanted to clean in here. So look at this little bunny. <laughs> you guys remember uh, these little ones? Yeah. So I have froze. This is frozen lake, which I had um, started. I need to finish that one off and I need to clean it up too because I like to keep them clean. This is a holder from last Christmas. Um, I have this holder. 
Then we have the Nintendo Switch. Um, that's the stuff that kind of was over here for the boys and I've taken over. Um, yeah, so we have, we don't have that many candles in this one. We have peppermint hot chocolate, iced cranberry scones, um, the peppermint sugar cookie. That's what I'm saying. I, I might move these uh, over there. And then blackberry cream frosting. I know I have more of this one. We have this holder here. I really do like this holder a lot. Most of my holders do have batteries. Uh, so there we go. Showing you that. I know we have these at work. I really do like that one. The palm tree one that I used a lot in the summer. We have the flock pumpkin. That'll be coming out uh, very soon after Halloween in November. Uh, dark vel velvet oud that's one of the newer candles that you guys know i got at um the outlets now this holder i'm going to be putting this like in that area over there very soon but not yet and then i have snowflakes and citrus i really do like this candle a lot we have my two pineapples in here so we have this one with that's green up here and then the one that has like the gold so those two are there. I don't want to take it out of the way. Okay, we have cypress and amber, which I love this candle. I do want more of these, but you know, right now, I just don't know. So the flock pumpkin, like I said, I'll be using it very soon. Um, that one is from last year. And then mountain teak wood. I did try this one, but I think I only tried it once. I need to burn. Oh, no, I burned it more than once. See, I don't even remember. So I need to finish that one off. A lot of the candles, what I'm going to try to do is move a lot of the candles and specifically into one area, the ones that I have started, because I want to finish a lot of my candles that way. I have room, right? I need to make room. Anyway, so that is this area here. I'm going to clean all this area. That's why I'm showing you guys. And then... Uh, so my candle holders, see, these are the things that were supposed to be here, like the kids' movies and movies. <laughs> yeah all of that but i've been putting my things are just everywhere now so sugared pomegranate this is just the empty holder that i saved it doesn't have a candle and so is this one the poppy is the empty one i didn't want to throw that one out eventually i'll see what i can use i know my mom wanted one too so maybe she'll take it but see we have the single with candle holders and then that's like the what do you call it like the hearts the rainbow one yeah Anyways, three-way candle holder back there. So that is what I have over here. And now let's just show you the rest of the candles in that other area. Okay, so right now I'm trying to decide if I put all of, if all these candle holders, it's not that many here. These are not all the ones I have. But anyways, if all these would fit into there somehow, and then whatever, there's not that many candles over there. I can move those over here. That's what I'm going to try to do. So we'll see if that works. But for now, since I have these candles out, you guys see I have three springtime in Paris. This one is halfway used, so I have to use that one up. This one, pink Prosecco frosting, is used as well. I can tell. I'm not going to right now open it but yeah it's used i need to finish that one we have bu this is brand new warm ocean breeze my, my husband really liked that one these aren't used the strong which is the eucalyptus mint and then we have honeysuckle and peach spritz i don't know if i even used see i did burn that one oh I'm trying to I'm trying not to do that no more. I'm trying here. Mango waters. I love this one. This one I used. I don't know if these are the lids for it. You know, I do have several lids that um I'll put different ones sometimes. Cactus blossom. And then we have raspberries and whipped vanilla. I really have burned a lot of these in the one wick and they're so strong and good. I haven't even tried the three wick, but I really do like that scent. I need to just show you guys so I can move on. Sweet red mango. I have two of those. I think I have more of these too. Maybe one more. Um, iced lemon pound cake. I have more of those in the room. Uh, you guys saw when I got this. If you watch all my videos only. Peach sugar cone. And then pink lilac and vanilla. I haven't tried that one. These are new. Uh, wild berry jam donut. Coconut cream pie. This that one's new. I know I have one that's halfway used. Enchanted candy potion. That one should be used because I have, I burned through one. Daydream. Thank you to Courtney who sent me this. And I think you sent me the cactus blossom as well. Walk in the woods. Haven't tried it yet because I'm trying to get through some candles and I'm not, I think I'm not going to try a lot of these right now because 
looking through my collection, I'm like, I want to burn through a lot of my candles. So fresh bamboo, you guys know I don't like earthy scents, but I got it because, yeah, I was giving it a try. And then love is love is love. I like the packaging. This is champagne toast that Courtney gave me as well. She gave me a whole bunch of you guys remember that huge friend mail that I got from her. And then we have positively sweet, which you guys know I have more in the room as well. I love that one so much. And then I love this one as well, which is the pink petal tea cake. And I have several more of that. I tried this one, coconut and vetiver. This is okay. I really do love coconut though. So um, I have this one. I, I did burn a little bit of cider lane. I was trying this one out. So I have burned. <laughs> I'm laughing at myself right now because it's like I have so many of these started. Suntan. I know so many of you guys don't like this one. I don't mind it, but this one's brand new. Uh, this is ice dragon fruit tea. Love this one. I have several of these in the other collection eventually you guys will see if i ever get to do like my full collection tropical island colada uh two of these here might have more <laughs> confident this is the champagne toast in this black history month collection just like the strong tiki beach this one's new i like it black tie my husband loves this in the wallflower form so yeah this is a good one i have not burnt the candle though uh, here we go. This is brand new apple macchiato into the night. I need to finish it too. Look, I am so bad. I am so I need to cut those wicks at the top when I burn it again into the night. This is brand new and I bought this one because of the collection. So I just wanted to have it in its different forms. And did I even talk about those? Yeah, these are new. Like I think I might use them this next summer in the bathroom. So right now I have I don't know. Uh, you had me at Aloha. Thank you, Courtney. I love the packaging. I wanted to burn this one. Like sometimes I feel like I want to burn it, but then I love the packaging. I might, you know, I might. So, but we'll wait maybe for next summer. Bergamot birch. So I think, look, this is brand new. Bergamot birch and birch. We have a single wick candle holder. I need to move that out of the way. We have this candle holder from last, um, this was from last Halloween. I really like it. I need to pull it out so I can use it. So we'll pull that out. Sweet cinnamon plum. Haven't tried it yet, but I did want to have it because I do eventually want to be able to try it. So I have that. Okay, I had to move some things around so that I can set more candles up here and then organize them after. So this is from last year's holder, like single wick holders here. And you guys see that and then the bunny one. So uh, we have this Somebody Loves You candle. I love this scent. Sweet carrot cake. It's so good. This is such a good one for fall too. And you can just put it in one of your holders, you know, like the sleeves or something to cover it, you know, so it won't show. Or you can show it this way. But you just put it in the sleeve if you don't want it to show like the bunny. And this one, I plan on burning this one for Thanksgiving. This is going to be my Thanksgiving burn on that day on the turkey you guys saw before and i say that to those that watch my videos uh black cherry seltzer so i'm trying to check to like which one i'll check later maybe um which ones i have burned or not and this one you guys know i tried or one of them i did because i have a new one yeah so i tried this one out already i'm gonna try to finish it off with something else as well like a blend and then we have this poppy single wick, which I haven't tried. I really love the packaging. I love the colored wax. I always say that. Cozy linen and nectarine. That was one of the candles I really did enjoy. I thought it was very um, like soothing and relaxing in my opinion. Uh, so graphite, I haven't. Oh yeah, I did try graphite. So <laughs> I need to finish some of these. I guess I'm not going to finish all of them. And here's a single wick holder that I'll be using uh, next month mostly. Not that I can't use it this month as well, actually, for Halloween. But we'll see. I'm going to take it out. I'm going to try to put some of these like toward the front so I make sure I use them. This is a fa one of my favorite candles, Sugared Lemonade. I know my husband loved this candle as well. We have Ocean Driftwood, which... I know a lot of people don't say it's like mahogany teakwood, but it kind of is to me. Um, 
so this one right here i don't i've heard really good things of coral waves and i didn't even try one yet but i'm still happy i have it in my collection because i love the way it smells and i do have to so i'm really happy about that now you guys see i don't think all the holders are gonna fit over there but maybe i'll use one of the top portions up here so this one i burned through one of them i really did enjoy it vintage i know i have a single wick as well i love this one it's really good um we have driftwood waves that i got in the when i went to the outlets but i have not been able to burn and honestly not gonna i do like it on cold a lot because of that sandalwood but i'm not gonna burn it yet until we burn through some of these other ones <laughs> that's what i'm gonna try to do so red white and blue cake love the blueberry scent of that candle we have i tried this one i actually really did like this one and i'm not a big on that sweet cinnamon pumpkin by itself but i do like sweater weather and i know it's earthy and that's just what it is i don't i'm not big on earthy but i do like some of them so that's that um we have this school holder see that's why it kind of helps to put candles in here so i think i'm still going to hold some candles in there like when i put them away because it just helps with storage like when i don't have enough room so i actually had candles in here that i took out but yes they each practically had hold um candles in them except for the single wicks but yes the three wicks did okay i took it out for now and this one is salted caramel pretzel which i ended up i really do like it burning i don't like it on cold that much still so but i like it burning so yeah and then we have this one here which i'm gonna finish off <laughs> i put it away because i started trying other candles this is another favorite pumpkin peanut brittle i like this one a lot i think i have a couple more somewhere else and we have hot cocoa and cream i really do enjoy this scent i'm gonna end up putting it in a sleeve and burning it very soon i plan on blending it with something else and look at this holder right here but this is um the sour melon drop we have there and yeah i really love that candle that's like they say i think that's a 12 out of 10 instead on a throw super super strong candle sweet like fruity for me salted caramel pretzel we have another one i'm telling you guys i really did end up loving this one so yeah i wouldn't mind even getting more but of course I don't need more probably get more anyways <laughs> thanksgiving celebration i don't like this one i wanted to complete you know my collection of having one of each of these so this one i only bought one i know i bought like two in this one and maybe the other one but this is the only one i only got one one in from that weekly candle drop and then look at this turkey from last year so yeah these are holders i will be using for this next month again this is vanilla santal i did burn it just a couple of times so again i think i'm gonna start leaving them in there this right here i forgot where my friend got this for me if it was like at a big lots or something but i'll take this out for christmas and i'll put like candy right there and set it out i think it'll be so cute so that's something uh it could be like a candle holder too i think let me see let's see like if you wanted to you could totally like put a candle right there like maybe like a christmas candle but i think that i want to use it as like candy i'm gonna put out candy for that christmas time christmas candy so there is that and then we have my single wig pineapple holder okay we have pumpkin bonfire i just took that one out of this holder right here last year's uh christmas holder that i have i have not even tried this one but i have it i'm happy to have it don't need to buy this year's version and i have some of the outlet candles out here dark velvet and oud i don't know if i have them all here but this is an area where i put some away so you guys know i bought like at least three and some just because you know i can't go to the outlet often and what if i really do love it so um so we have we have peppered plum that one there these are new because i did take some out that i was trying out but they're not in here smoked vanilla whiskey this one i'm trying one out in alex's room and um i have some thoughts on it but i wanna i'm comparing it to the smoked 
uh, smoked vanilla one that doesn't say whiskey. So yeah, I've been burning one in each room, like separate rooms, just to compare for myself. Um, banana walnut muffin. I need to finish that one off. I do like it a lot. Um, I never even tried. Look, I have this leaf. This is uh, like leaves basically from last year. And I never even tried the candle that's in here. So the candle that was in there is chocolate banana mudslide. Look, I never even tried it. I feel like I heard like bad things and a couple of good things. So maybe like half and half. I got berry waffle cone is a candle I really do like because I wanted to have it in this packaging too. But I have it in a couple of other packagings as well. And then we have... Peppered plum, so another peppered plum. I have pink lemonade in this Love You Mom packaging, which I do like, but I love the pink lemonade candle, so that's why I got it, because I really like that candle. This is Sour Melon Drop in this packaging here. Let me take it out. So here's the sleeve. It's almost like I'm showing you what holders I have as well, guys. So Sour Melon Drop. We have Girlfriend brand new girlfriend i like to have the different ones from the holidays or from halloween i mean so that i can show you guys and compare hopefully next year and all of that but here is another sleeve and then my coconut this is my coconut cream pie i need to like finish burning that one i'm going to be blending several candles here so i could fin i'm scared that's gonna fall so we have another bergamot birch this one is the one i have started and tried so do do need to finish off that one and i have the other one that's brand new so there is that and then you guys remember this candle holder i had this one up for a long time i should bring him out soon and use it too now we have i haven't tried these here so we have coffee and tonka so left in here we have caramel cream soda haven't tried it paradise cove i think i did try this one nope i did not so i thought i did um and we have fresh spring morning in here we still have caramel cream soda paradise cove fresh spring morning and we have cozy linen and nectarine because i really like that one like i told you guys positively sweet that one is started already so is pumpkin carving i think that one is so strong that in my husband hates pumpkin scents that one lingers so uh butterfly i know i have other pumpkin scents but i feel like i could burn them while he's at work and it doesn't linger as much <laughs> that one does butterfly i have two of those right there i'm really happy to have those now i can dust and put all these things back in here we are i'm showing you a little bit of what i did here i have all these candles here no particular order i just put them in some i kept in, or inside of the of holders because well it's just for space I can't have like a specific space just for the holders. I tried to put some over there, which I'll show you here in a minute, um, but they weren't all going to fit over there. So here we are just showing you how it looks right now. And I'm trying to finish these off. These are the ones that have been started. So this is what I'm going to be working on. And when you guys see empties and you see a whole bunch of empties, it's because of this. But as it is right now, I have like 10 candles around the house. So we'll finish those first and then these will come out. Um, here is this area. And then because that other area in the kitchen where I'm supposed to be putting, you know, some of these items like the waffle maker, the <laughs> waffle maker is here for now until I take everything out, whether I put it in storage or whatever I do. And then we can use that area over there, that cabinet for, you know, all the kitchen appliances and all that. I had to put that in here. So here is that. So yeah. So there is some of my candles, like you guys saw the other ones, and then let me show you this area. Now here is this area, just candle holders, pedestals, and sleeves, and back there is Nintendo Switch, and I don't even know what other thing is back there. Some of the movies, but again, candle holders, and that soap holder right there. Those little empty ones, because like I said, I want to use those too uh, for something I don't know yet, but yeah, those are there. And that is all that I have for you guys today. I hope that you guys truly enjoyed this little quick video. Probably not that quick, but anyways, until the next one, my friends. I love you guys so, so much. Please stay blessed. Bye.